Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be on a review on the Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipstick. I have a total of 8 of them in my hands and I've actually had these for over a year. This is not going to be a first impression and I will say out there right now that this is actually one of my top liquid lipsticks that I use on a daily basis. So I don't know, I don't know why I haven't done this video yet. Uh, and even though I've had these for the longest time now, I don't know why. I love them so much. So this video, I'm going to be doing swatches uh, for you guys on my lips, on my arm. And I'm also going to wear one color throughout the day just to show you guys how great this uh, particular product wears. So I'm going to just do a quick little uh, reading on the brand just so you guys get a quick idea of what this is if you don't know uh this brand yet because funny to say you know this brand has been out for uh a while already a lot of people still don't know what this brand is when i let them know or actually I'm not making any sense right now i'm not let me just let me just kind of start all over when people ask me why i'm wearing my lips and I say i'm wearing jeffree star on my lips they're like what is that if you're not in the beauty world or the youtube I want to say world, then you don't know uh, these particular brands. The more common brands would be like MAC lipsticks, Revlon, lots of drugstore kind of lipstick. Colourpop is really common one too. But you say like uh, Jeffree Star Lego lipsticks, those of colors. Even when I say those of colors, a lot of people don't know that brand or they never tried that brand before. So even though this has been quite been out for a while, I feel like people don't know much about the brand and it's a it's quite an amazing product. So I'm actually on the Jeffree Star's Cosmetics uh, website. Uh, liquid lipstick goes on opaque, dries, completely matte and stays on for hours. Product is 100% vegan and cruelty free. Tips before use, exfoliate, then apply to rear lips, avoid food with oil, and no making out kisses are okay. So this is paraben and gluten free and it's 0.19 ounces. So I have a total of six of his liquid lipsticks in his uh, normal regular collection and they are in the pink too. And then I got two of his most recent colors from his latest collection which is a chrome collection and the uh, cap is actually this gorgeous chrome uh, color like that. It comes with a dropper applicator like this. And when you shut it, it snaps with a little click so nothing comes out from the product. I do want to say that his latest collection, which is a chrome collection, uh, he changed the uh, the tip of it. This is the tip from the old one. It has the little furries, uh, furry hairs and they are a lot longer. And then the tip from the new collection, the tip, uh, the furs or hair you want to, I want to say is actually really, really short. I hope you guys can see that. So I've actually had this liquid lipstick on my hand for, I want to say maybe a good more than three minutes, less than five minutes. And um, it hasn't even fully dry. So let me just scoot over and show you guys. It's, this is a dry, it's a complete matte finish, but it it's not completely what it claims to, uh, which is what I love about this particular product even though it says it dries to a matte finish it does dry to a matte finish but it gives a little bit of leeway where it's not completely dry it's more of a light semi matte finish so if i do this i can feel it a little bit on my fingers so let me just show you guys you can see it kind of uh smearing on the bottom and then uh let me just show you the darker ones so you know what i'm talking about if i do that red that one and that one so now that i am close you can see what i'm talking about how it's got uh how it's smearing on the bottom like this 
which is actually quite what works out for the product because um, you don't want it to be completely matte like certain products. If it's too matte, it's going to start cracking. When you talk, it's, your lips can start peeling, which is what I hate about certain liquid lipstick. But I feel like he nailed it on the spot with this particular product. So I thought we'd do a little bit of comparison just to show you guys what I mean by the product. It being matte but not too matte. I'm going to compare it to ColourPop's liquid lipstick. This is in Thule. And if you are aware, um, their liquid lipsticks are hit and miss. So sometimes they're too matte. And I'm also going to apply the uh, Kylie liquid lipstick in the color Expose. And I will apply it um, next to... Uh, Leo by Jeffree Star. Okay, so I'm just gonna put the back of my hand. This is ColourPop. I'm just gonna put it here. Ivy's. Put it right there. Jeffree's. Right there. ColourPop's already dried, and Kylie's is already dry, and Jeffree's is not dry yet. You probably can't tell from camera, but for me, blown and looking at it in person, Jeffree's took the longest to dry, and ColourPop took the shortest time to dry. So I'm just going to do that and you can see that look. I'm doing it pretty hard. Color pops. And then this is the Exposed by Kylie's. I'm doing it really hard. Okay. And this is Jeffrey's. And if you can see, it smears right there. A lot of people like that uh, certain liquid listing you don't have uh, this. They'd rather have it be like this. But if you notice here, I'm kind of like scratching it off. And you can see that it's flaking off. Can you imagine wearing this throughout the day? It's flaking off. Kylie's is not as bad actually. But with Jeffrey's, you can do that all day and it's not going to flake. With that, it's flaking, it's cracking. You can see the, my skin showing through, which is really unattractive. I am actually going to be using some Neutrogena makeup remover cleansing towelettes. You gotta use a makeup mommy, wipe remover like this and you got on my mommy? hand. But yes, even with this, it's hard to come off. And it's staining too. I don't know if you guys can see, but it stains a tad bit. I just assumed I'd play the part. Keeping you in the right direction No matter how, how your confidence may fall I'll be here as your foundation And I say, hey, you just let it go Your struggles won't That was painful trying to do the swatches of just those eight local lipsticks. Um, what's on my lips right now is actually Family Jewels, which is from his Chrome um, collection. So I'm going to be leaving this on my lips. And cutie, come here. What time is it? Give it. Let me see. I give it back. 
<laughs> it is currently six uh six forty six right now. So I can't leave this on too late because it's late already. But I'll leave on for at least four hours and show you guys how this wears throughout the day. So I don't know if you guys can tell from uh, me doing the swatches on my lips. I applied it over a couple of times to show you guys how nice this wears or how nice this applies on your lips because um if you guys are aware a lot of liquid lipsticks when you apply it on it dries so fast that you don't have time to go over and fix your mistakes and when you apply it again or uh, the second time it starts to crack it doesn't layer well hey guys so i am back i don't have my phone with me because lexi took it but it is just a little bit past 11 p.m so I've had this liquid lipstick on for a little bit over four hours. I had a little bit of chips and I drank a little bit of Gatorade. Um, but you guys can see that it still looks really nice even after four hours. No cracking. It would have smacked my lips. Still kiss. It's a slight little residue you can see from there. I'm going to go ahead and reapply this on. And also, as you guys can tell, there is no fading unless you're eating a lot of greasy food. Almost don't even need to reapply oh, this on. Oh, that's so pretty. Yes, you are. I like my steps. My, my, my lipsticks are going away. Yeah, I don't even need to reapply this on because, honestly, I don't. This, there's no fading in I these Luka lipsticks, which is... Pretty awesome. Alright guys, so I think that pretty much wraps it up for this video. Hope you guys found it helpful. You guys did, please give it a thumbs up. And I will catch you guys on my next video. Bye guys.